Microsoft just unveiled a new AI model that's pretty much the closest humanity has ever come to artificial general intelligence. This AI can autonomously browse web pages, gather information from various sources, and interact with software applications. Sounds like fiction. Well, not anymore. In today's video, we'll break down Microsoft's Gorilla AI and explain how it can independently interact with a variety of online tools and string processes together like magic. Welcome back, everyone. It's time for AI. Here we cover the latest news and breakthroughs in the field of artificial intelligence. Today, we'll be talking about Microsoft's Gorilla AI and describing its amazing autonomous capabilities. Subscribe to our channel and hit that notification button so you can stay up to date on everything hot in the field of AI. At its core, Gorilla is a large language model, or LLM, just like GPT-4 used in ChatGPT. However, Gorilla's capabilities extend way beyond. It's an AI model that can access and use the application programming interfaces, or APIs, of several online tools, thereby bridging tasks together to create seamless processes. Gorilla, a joint venture between Microsoft and the University of California, Berkeley, was recently released as an open source repository on GitHub. How can you use Gorilla's amazing capabilities to create a powerful personal assistant powered by AI available at your fingertips? Keep watching till the end to find out. Have you used virtual assistants before? What would you say are the most challenging tasks virtual assistants have helped you complete? Let us know in the comments below. Gorilla vs. GPT-4 As stated in the white paper, Gorilla is an LLM that can provide appropriate API calls. It was extensively trained on three massive machine learning datasets, TensorFlow Hub, Torch Hub, and Hugging Face. Gorilla is based on an LLAMA, and it is claimed that it can surpass even the mighty GPT-4 on writing API calls. Now, you might be wondering what exactly is an API call and how this is relevant. An API call is basically a request to an application to carry out a task or provide a service. For example, when you search online for a flight booking, your search engine will make API calls to the websites of different carriers to obtain the flight data that suits your requirements. It can actually learn to use any tools. Now, anything that can be done on the internet can be done by Gorilla, a new project out of Microsoft and UC Berkeley. Booking trips, ordering food, watching YouTube. Now, imagine a tool that does that for you. Just think of the endless possibilities. Gorilla is superior to other LLMs when it comes to making API calls in the following ways. Firstly, it can accurately produce the syntax and prompts for any API call without the errors that are commonly made by other LLMs. Secondly, it minimizes hallucination errors, meaning it doesn't make up information, which is false or irrelevant. And lastly, it is more flexible and adaptable than other LLMs. It can also handle changes in versions of APIs without breaking down or losing functionality. Gorilla is also constantly evolving, meaning it can learn from new sources of information dynamically. It can assimilate data from web pages or documentation on the fly and improve the quality of its API calls. Lastly, Gorilla can handle much more complex API calls than its competitors. Artificial general intelligence will almost definitely look like this. Well, not that, this. This AI is a large language model trained to use tools. What's more, it can string together multiple API calls that span across many applications and thereby carry out complex tasks that require interactions with different domains or platforms. Before we move on, take a moment to subscribe to our channel and hit that notification button so you won't miss out on any updates. Gorilla's Foundations Gorilla's development began with the construction of an extensive collection of APIs called API Bench. By extracting machine learning APIs from the previously described sources, TensorFlow Hub, Torch Hub, and Hugging Face, the API Bench contained 1,645 API calls during the initial training phase. The researchers at Microsoft then used self-instruction to create pairs of instructions and matching API calls. This data was then used to fine-tune the LLAMA 7B model. However, it's not quite as simple as that. API calls bring complexities of specific constraints that add a layer of difficulty to the LLM's understanding and categorization. This calls for reasoning capabilities to break down the embedded constraints. The incorporation of these capabilities is what sets Gorilla apart from other vanilla LLMs like our beloved GPT-4. 
use cases. Hopefully by now you've understood that Gorilla can do pretty much any task that involves using tools and software on the internet. Picture this, you can ask Gorilla to book flights to New York for the dates when there are the least amount of tourists in the city. Gorilla would then access demographic and tourism websites that have data on the number of tourists in New York, identify the weeks or months with the lowest number, and then access flight booking websites to book flights for those dates. Not much of a traveler? All right, imagine this. You ask Gorilla to order you a pizza and some fried chicken from two different restaurants. It would then access food delivery apps to place separate orders from the restaurants you requested for. Here's a simpler example. You can ask Gorilla to order you the best rated noise canceling headphones for the cheapest price. It would then access tech review websites to gain information on the best rated headphones currently on the market and then check different e-commerce websites to find the lowest price of those headphones and then place the order. Pretty cool, right? Comment below what you see yourself using the powerful Gorilla AI for. In case you want to test it out for yourself, you can access it via the Google Collab Notebook or the command line interface. You can also check out Gorilla's Spotlight Search feature, which is a web-based interface that allows you to search for any task or question and get the corresponding API call. Future. As you might have expected, it's not all sunshine and rainbows. Gorilla still has some limitations and challenges that prevent it from being truly general and intelligent, meaning AGI is still quite a distance away. Some of the limitations are its inability to handle tasks that require creativity and emotion, which can actually be handled to some capacity by other LLMs such as GPT-4. Another limitation of Gorilla is its reliance on human-generated datasets and documentation to learn how to perform the API calls. However, Gorilla is a huge step forward in the road to achieving AGI, and it definitely solves problems that have not been addressed before. Its reduction of hallucination errors is already a major breakthrough for LLMs. Being made available as open source, it remains to be seen how engineers will extend and improve Gorilla, possibly combining it with other LLMs to offset its limitations and take us even closer to the realization of AGI. In conclusion, there is no doubt about the potential of Gorilla. Although currently in its infancy, it is a testament to the heavy focus and investment of resources in AI by many large corporations who continue to push boundaries and bring forth revolutionary innovations. Who knows, maybe eventually we'll look back at Gorilla as the turning point in the AI race. Thank you for watching It's Time for AI. If you enjoyed this video, make sure to give it a thumbs up and hit the subscribe button. We'll be back again shortly.